Good day, and welcome to another edition of the Military and Foreign Affairs Network. I am your host, the Voice of Reason. So, uh, we are receiving reports that uh, the United States government, specifically uh, key members of the uh, State Department, have uh, ordered the, uh, the government of Eatria, led by Afwerki, to immediately withdraw all forces, all Eatrian forces, from Tigray. Why is this happening? Well, uh, we, uh, we believe that uh, several reports have made it to the presidential brief uh, indicating uh, a, uh, a, a heavy-handed approach into the region uh, along with the uh, human atrocities that are being committed by the Eritrean and Ethiopian government. So again, in all likelihood, the President of the United States have, has been debriefed on what is occurring in places like Adagrat, Adwa, Aksum, Shire, and uh, the mass uh, extermination of human beings that are being occurred. The uh, other issue as well that is uh, coming across is the operation of irregular forces, specifically the uh, Amara Militia. Uh, the um, Amara Militia is also committing significant human rights abuses in western Tigray in this area. Um, in other reports from the region, it would appear that there is a significant offensive by Ethiopian National Defense Forces underway. Uh, we at the Military and Foreign Affairs Network believe that uh, the cause of this offensive is the immense scrutiny that is occurring uh, by the United, United States at this point. So the uh, Ethiopian Defense Forces are looking to gain as much leverage as possible. And uh, while they attempt to gain this leverage, they are utilizing multi-role fighter bombers, uh, helicopter, attack helicopter gunships, uh, specifically targeted towards uh, Samre and the Gillette area, Gidget area, and uh, are pressing an offensive uh, towards central Tigray. Now, whether that will pan out and be successful, uh, we have yet to see. There are reports of columns of Ethiopian National Defense Forces uh, that have been moved into the vicinity of Samre. Uh, how successful those forces are in terms of actually encountering and defeating uh, uh, Tigray uh, defense forces, uh, that is a, uh, another matter unto itself. Uh, you can move forces into the region. However, if you are not actively engaging combatants other than using uh, dumb bombs and multi-role fighter bombers to bomb civilian targets, then uh, your, uh, your chance of actually degrading the opposing force is uh, actually going the other way because you are simply enraging the in population, the existing population, which will then provide more soldiers to uh, to fight against uh, the uh, the cause of the EDF of the uh, Ethiopian Defense Forces. But again, it, it sounds like uh, the United States is putting significant pressure on Eritrea, and there is actually talk in back channels that uh, the United States could, with its international partners, uh, take military action against Eritrea if they do not uh, listen to the call of reason to stop human rights abuses, to stop the mass killings of peoples, and uh, withdraw their forces from Tigray. <laughs>